Howdy train fans. Welcome back to the Chattanooga Southern Railroad. Um, sorry I haven't posted in a little bit. I've been doing some business travel uh, and, and a lot of stuff going on at work. Uh, and I got a, another trip coming up here. Um, but wanted to throw you a quick bone uh, about what's been happening. Uh, so if you remember last time I was getting ready to do some major work for the backdrop and, and whatnot. So I have completely cleared off the layout of any extraneous cars, except for a few. Yes, if you have picked up on it, I have yet another caboose that I have bought uh, off of eBay. This is a one of the Black Roof uh, Atherns. Uh, thought it was something I didn't have, so I had to get it. Okay, don't judge me. All right, so uh, a couple of little things that I have done is uh we'll start over here is i have pulled finally dug out and it was a pain all the um kd uh, uh delayed uncoupling ramps here there and then over behind the caboose there um i am not going to dig this one out uh it's just i i just don't want to do it after having done the other three it's not worth my effort a um, couple of the things I have decided, I've figured out the position of this curve turnout to give me access behind the backdrop there. Um, but I have decided I'm going to tear this uh, Y out. This position of this track doesn't work anymore. It was originally going to be a programming track for the layout. I don't need that anymore. I've got another plan. So I need this Y over there. So I'm going to transplant it. So a um, couple of the things, as you can see here, I've started cutting my two inch foam board to start the tunnel area over here. Oops, sorry for the unfocusing there. Um, and so I should be able to get that up and going uh, next time we talk. Uh, I also did some more jiggering of track uh, after lots of thought and back and forth, I have opted not to put the turntable in here. So one of the main reasons I chose this was because that Walther's kit is one of the older kits, uh, even though it's motorized. Everything I was watching on YouTube and reading online say it's a complete hassle to get to work with any kind of digital command control. So I think I'm going to spare myself that headache. Uh, since this layout is technically an interim layout uh, for before I start building the dream one um, and another location in my home. Um, so I've decided to build kind of like an engine servicing facility. The nice thing about that is it's allowed me to put two more tracks here in this yard. So I will now have six tracks across here. And with the plan to build a flip up section here that's going to come out 42 inches, uh, that's going to give me a nice yard over here for operations. So uh, I, uh, I actually like that idea a whole lot better. Um, I do finally have all the materials I need to do what I need to do as far as the structure of all this, including um, my fascia that I have planned. And so what I've got planned for that is, and I've been agonizing over this, as to how far down to come down with that. Uh, at first, I thought I was going to do something small. Then I said, well, no, I'm going to do a foot. Well, that takes it all the way down, you know, way down here. Um, and then I've settled on 10 inches total uh, around the layout. And that gives me plenty of room to do the control panels I want at each of the different uh, control points. And I think that's going to work out really well. I am planning on painting the back or the uh, fascia black to help emphasize what's going on on the layout. So there is that. Uh, other than that, I'll step back here a little bit and give you a full view of the track plan. So you can see that and I'll pan over so you can see over there. Uh, one question I did get asked by a local 
uh, to me, not on YouTube, was why did I pick the track arrangements that I did? Well, if you'll notice that this is a two by eight foot section, I wanted to pick something that I could then pick up and put into a new layout somewhere else and it work, right? So I did that in my thinking around this section as well as this section and the sub and I'll do that as with the subsequent uh, portion over here. So that's why I did that. Um, I will be having an episode of the letter rip track. If you remember for over here, uh, coming up, I've finally gotten enough questions for that. Uh, so be on the lookout for that as well. And lots of, uh, updates coming. So until then, We'll see you on down the tracks. Bye, everyone.